Hi, it's Karen here with a few tips on working with the Balloon Builder stamp set. This is really a fun set to make all kinds of cute things. So I have a variety of cards here. In making this teddy bear, I just wanted to point out that whenever I was doing overlapping, when I made the bear himself, so for instance, I'll just show you, and I don't even have the right stamps here, but when then when I was overlapping, say the arms. There was just too much in the middle here that I didn't like. So what I did was I stamped another of the bigger balloon, cut that out, and laid over the top. So it just made kind of a fun back. You can make all kinds of really adorable animals with this. Here is the balloon. I thought for a really, the heart balloon. And I just have a stamp here from the Timeless Treasures. Just adds a lot on the border, but I thought this would be a really fun card to, get to give to someone who just got engaged. It says love is in the air and couldn't be simpler. And then I love that you can make flowers out of the balloon. So here I have two different sizes. It might be a little hard to see with the yellow, and I've just trimmed it. I did the yellow and black because I used the tape from It's My Party Washi Tape. And I love the styling of yellow and black together. So with that, I just wanted to just show that... The yellow might be a little hard to see, so we'll do it a little. This is the inside, so by taking that around to make the flower, and then I just have the one of the little bigger circles, and I'm going around on the inside. But isn't that pretty how you can get this two-tone look for flowers? So I just love the variety of things in this stamp set. Oh, and the last thing, um, to do the flower stem, I used the balloon string. And my tip for doing that is to use a marker because it's just really easy to wobble on when you're doing on ink pad. But by laying your marker flat like that, you won't pick up any edges. So some fun tricks with balloon builders. Thanks for watching.